So are you still using Protractor to do your testing? Not this Protractor, this Protractor. So if you're still using Protractor in August or after August 2023, well, you need to know that it will reach its end of life in a few days. So what can you do? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you uh, an alternative or a way to migrate your Protractor tests to Cypress. So I'm going to post a link in the description to this migrator from Protractor to Cypress. So how does this work? Well, on the left side, you just input your code in Protractor and you say migrate to Cypress and this will automatically change the syntax to Cypress syntax. Now you have a couple of uh, commands that can be migrated so it will not migrate everything that uh, you might think or desire. Uh, it's just a uh, starting, let's say, starting migration tool. Uh, and if you want to learn more or go into depths of this migration tool, you can just open the migration guide. And in the migration guide, you have examples of how this exactly works. So you have um, all of the assertions that you can do working with the DOM and everything that can be used or can be migrated or how you can do the migration. You can either use the migration tool or you can follow the migration guide one to one. So it has tests and examples that you can follow to the rule. And in the end, you will get your protector tests migrated into Cypress. Give it a go, write into the comments how many tests you migrate, if you have any issues with the migration tool. And as always, thank you for watching the video and I will see you in the next one. Have a good one and bye bye.